These are, of course, some of the many images that I took of the Pharaoh cell, which is an image of the reciprocating processional hyperboloid that defines a magnet. <clears throat> some people would call it a spirograph-like pattern, a vortex, obviously, that forms over any magnetic polarity. So can you have a uh, vortex pattern actually form on a planetary scale? Well, you sure can. So anyway, this is the uh, North Pole of Mars. This is a frozen carbon dioxide. I'll post the link below. Uh, what's happening is that the frozen carbon dioxide um, is actually forming along a vortex pattern as it's being deposited on the North Pole of Mars due to the magnetic field of Mars. So the frozen CO2 is settling along uh, field compression uh, lines along the North Pole or the apex of the magnetic pole of Mars. So... I thought you would think that was uh, very neat. Everything, of course, in nature is pressure mediation, so the same thing as occurs underneath the ferro cell. Uh, I'll post the link below and let you take a look at it. So basically we have a planetary, planetary version of the ferro cell wherein which a vortex uh, is uh, patterned via frozen carbon dioxide in a planetary-wide... A magnetic field. Mother Nature is extremely simplex.